Hey guys, this is Brad with Camo Fire, and we've got a cool new product that we're selling. Uh, it is the Birchwood KC Honeycomb Holster. Uh, basically what this is, it's a sleeve style holster that you can wear in your pocket and it's got a sticky exterior. So when the gun is in the pocket, in the holster, the holster stays put, gun comes out. What I personally like to do is I wear these appendix or just um, offset of appendix. Uh, inside the waistband, uh, they stay put just fine, don't really go anywhere, and they, they work just like a, a normal holster that would have a clip, but they don't have a clip. Instead, they have this sticky finish. Uh, let me walk you through the basics of the lineup, sizing. That's always difficult. Anyone who's been uh, in the gun world for a long enough period of time knows that uh, you've got a drawer full of holsters, half of them don't get used, just because the sizing is a little bit off. So. Hopefully this will take a little bit of that uh, pain out of the buying process. Uh, I've got a few guns here. Uh, I don't have all the guns. I'm working on getting more, but uh, uh, this will give us a pretty good idea of sizes and then you can compare your pistol to the one here size-wise. That way you can uh, be on the right track to, to fit your particular gun. Um, first up, we've got the size number four. This is going to be a really popular one because a lot of guys are going to want to carry uh, pocket carry. Uh, Ruger LCPs, any of those micro 380s that have really become so popular the last uh, five or six years. Uh, the particular gun I have is a Tomcat from Beretta. Uh, fits in there really great. Um, you're going to have the same effect with it, like I said, any of the LCP size guns. This one would be great for pocket carry. So there's your sizing. Next up uh, is an emerging gun size category that is very popular, and that's your single stack nine millimeters. We've got the size 11 right here. Uh, sample gun I have is a 43X. This one goes in there really nice, really snug around all the corners, fits it perfect. Uh, I couldn't find a, a particular size example uh, that they list on the box for like a J-frame carry revolver. I've got an older uh, 36 uh, right here, so it's pretty much same size as your J-frame. Um, and it covers trigger guard, trigger, or hammer, excuse me. Uh, you like carrying the J-frames just like I do. Uh, that'd be the ticket there, that's the size 11. Here's where things get a little bit more confusing. Uh, they recommend the size one to fit kind of your full size double stack autos. But I've found, um, depending on the trigger guard size, you're gonna wanna go to the size five. So I've got a Glock 19, a SIG 229, a full size Glock 17, and a Taurus Millennium. So these ones all fit in this size five really well. I think it's the best fit for the Glock, especially because the Glock, as you know, has, has a little bit larger uh, trigger guard. So that's the one I would recommend uh, for any of the Glocks. 320s, I, I imagine to be the same. Uh, as you can see here, the, my 229 fits in there great. These will break in a little bit as you wear them. They mold over and your gun pretty much becomes kind of a custom fit. So you can see there, that's the one I would roll with as size five for your 229, your midsize, large full trigger guard, uh, double stack pistols. So that's, that's what I would recommend there. So here's the 17. So this is your full size Glock, but as you can see here, goes all the way in, covers the trigger guard, leaves enough room for the magazine release, covers it really well. Um, I like this one a little bit better than say the size one. As you can see here, it'll hang up on the trigger guard in the front here. It'll hang up and you have all this extra room here in the front. So. Anything Glock, I would say, probably throw it in the size five. Um, and here's the Taurus. So that's kind of a good double stack midsize, maybe a smaller midsize uh, right there. And then last, back to the size one, I found this works best on full size, lower profile trigger guards. So anything, you know, four and a half inch barrel above, a little bit lower profile trigger guard. So 1911 full size, that goes in, fits it great. Barrel goes all the way to the end and you've got plenty of coverage on all the controls. And then about as big as you're gonna get in full-size pistols, Breda 92 M9 series. Uh, this one as well fits in there really good. Uh, all Barrel all the way to the end, covers up trigger, access to controls still. I think that'd be the best fit there for, 
for your full size double stack, a uh, little bit lower profile trigger guard. This is kind of real basic sizing. So kind of take what you've seen here, apply it to the pistol you have. Really, really nice high quality holsters. They're gonna be awesome to carry uh, for your concealed weapon carry guys. Or if you just want some weapon security as you store them, they have nice padding, really, really nice holster. So check them out. Any questions, please give us a call. Thanks.